this young girl was brutally unalived by her ex-boyfriend, a young man known as Fatai Mogaji, on the 10th of July 2024. It is said that on that fateful day, the deceased went clubbing at Bell's Bar in Ikurudu. There she met with her ex-boyfriend. After the exchange pleasantries, it is unknown what transpired, but they seem to have sparked their old flames. And after clubbing, she followed her ex-boyfriend home. Now, barely a few hours after the old lovers had rekindled their love, they got into a fight at about 5 a.m. in the boyfriend's house. The cause of that fight is not known at this moment, but the young man was said to have picked up a knife, stabbed the young lady brutally until she was breathless. The young man proceeded to wrap her body and dumped it in his kitchen before locking his doors and went away without anybody having any idea as to where he had been since then. The landlord discovered what had happened. Not much information is available at this moment as to how the landlord got to find out, but he alerted the police and the girl's family got to know about what tragedy had happened to their daughter. The older sister of the deceased made some tweets where she alleged that Fatai stabbed her younger sister 22 times before she gave up the ghost. Currently, they are asking for anyone who's got relevant information as to the whereabouts of this young man to report to the nearest police station so that he will be arrested to account for this evil that he has done to a young girl who had a whole bright future ahead of her. It is quite tragic and we pray that the soul of the deceased will rest in peace. And may God comfort her family and her loved ones. Guys, it is a cold world and as I always say, you cannot be too careful. Look out for yourself and stay safe. I would love to know your thoughts about this tragic story. Put your thoughts in the comment section. I would love to read and engage. In the meantime, guys, take care of yourself. Take care of your emotions. Take care of your mental health. Be kind to yourself. Be kind to the people around you. And always stay safe. I remain Dorcas Ige Olukun and I love you guys.